Hey, are, are you wasting prospects like it's not already hard enough? You know, in my experience, many advisors do. They contact a prospect once, get offended by a no, and then discard the name with disgust. But the best agents that I know keep every prospect in play forever. My friend Van Miller was just saying that the other day. They don't discard prospects who say no. They know that prospecting is a matter of good timing. And they keep calling until the timing is right for the prospect to meet. Kind of like the Verizon mobile guy on TV, Paul Marcarelli says, can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Our job is to keep calling prospects until they are ready to hear us now. But if you only contact prospects once, prospecting is a very, very disheartening job. Let's be honest, you sell one out of ten prospects and discard nine. You work hard but lose most of the time. Instead, if you keep working on the nine that you couldn't meet or you couldn't sell, your past effort pays off for you and eventually you have a big reservoir of people you are now getting to know personally. You know, if only 45 seconds at a time. So, what if, when you couldn't get an appointment with a good prospect, you just said something like, you know, it's been a pleasure speaking with you. The times change and people change. Would you mind if I kept you on my list and called you again? Most people say yes because it's easy. And if the prospects you meet don't buy, say, you know, it's been a real pleasure working with you. The times change and people change. Would you mind if... I check back with you in, in a few months. With just this one line, you'll have more meetings, make more sales, and have more fun, and it won't be so disheartening. Remember, professionals are never offended, and they don't burn bridges either and waste prospects. So stick with good prospects, and you'll sell more. God bless. Hey, and I'm looking forward to seeing you at the Canada Sales Congress Wednesday, October 18th. In the meantime, I'll see you again next week. And go be amazing.